Well, to the movies now, as acclaimed filmmaker Tolu Lotena leads the cast and crew of his new action thriller, Hide and Seek, to the red carpet premiere in Lagos, southwest Nigeria. The movie's lead cast, Kiki Omeli, Kunle Remy, Efa Iwara, reveals in excitement being part of one of the first action thriller movies in Nollywood. Evicted Big Brother Niger Shine Your Eyes housemates Yusuf, Michael, Tega and others join cast and crew of Tulu Lord Tana's Hide and Seek on the red carpet as the movie makes its way into the Nigerian box office. You did what? Co-directed by Lord Tana alongside longtime associate Brian Oyetunde, the movie makes a detour from the regular Nollywood romantic drama and comedy genre to explore the action thriller group. When I met uh, Bode um, Ashinobi, who is the writer of the story, you know, he told me that he wanted to make a different film, you know. And when he, the idea he shared with me was, you remember the folklore song when we were growing up where you sang Boju Boju, Ororo Mbo, you know. And so from there, the idea developed that we should create something that reflected people, the Nigerian people, something that people would relate with. And so when we went out to make um, Boju Boju, which we eventually changed to hide and seek because we wanted something to be, wanted something universal, something that people would, you know, see and appreciate anywhere in the world. You know, we decided that we we're going to make it hide and seek. And so when we developed the story, it evolved over time. Film, you know, in its nature, is supposed to reflect society. It's supposed to reflect the pains, uh, the expressions, the difficulties, the challenges, the victories of, you know, society. And when we set out to make this film, one of our intentions was to ensure that we made something that um, not just, you know, entertain people, also mirror them. We have a general understanding of what we want to do together. And because we've been working for, for quite a number of years, we've worked for like uh, six to seven years. So, so we, have, we have an understanding. And, and um, we, we came together to bring, is bringing a lot of performance and bringing a lot of technicality. The main challenge is budget. It is really budget. Why? Because to achieve things like this, you need time and to use time to achieve this in its excellence you need budget for that time that period of time so but most times the, the, the production budgets might not carry some of these so that's why most times we try, we try to play low on technicalities so that we do not make a mess of it in the, in the film in general so basically it's, it is budget budget is a major challenge wait for my call we're well, having that meeting with Teluga tonight. Tonight? Hotel 1914. I'm done with the operation now and I'll head to the hotel. Kisa Sisi and I are going to meet you tonight. We hand over the cash and we are done. We are looking forward to tonight. Everything is perfect. The bag is gone. There is a problem. It's the movie stars Kunle Remy, Sani Muazu, Uche Montana, Efa Iwara, Bimbo Ademoye, Kiki Omeli, and many others. What do we do? We run. You move, you die. For me, in as much as I love drama, in as much as I love um, comedy, I am actually a fan of action films. So um, doing this, it's just a dream come through to taste, you know, what is to come. Um, preparation for it was, uh, was, 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 was pretty good because here's the thing. I'm a fitness person. So right from time, as being a fitness person, it was easy for me to jump into it and get into it. But then again, you know, aside from reading it, I have a friend that works with the DSS. It was easy for me to just communicate, understand their mannerisms and all that. And, you know, normally Nigerian police don't carry... Um, 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 they carry um, AKs, and uh, yeah, we had to do with pistols and stuff. So that was a good thing to to, to experience. Now the good thing is I've, I've out of my travels or for my travels, I've had moments where I've gone to gun ranges. So I know how to handle a gun, hold a gun, cock a gun, and and that just gave me more more ginger. A huge amount of money has gone missing in this hotel, and everyone is a suspect. We are filmmakers, so we try to entertain, right? But at the end of the day, we also don't want to go overboard. We don't want to make it look like, you know, the bad guys are the good guys that we should root for and they are the guys that we should aim to be like. So I think that while telling an entertaining story and, you know, making the villain look glamorous, 
it might also kind of help if that villain at the end of the day were to meet some kind of Waterloo or have some kind of punishment, you know, so that so that it, we don't appear to be glamorizing villains. But you know, it's it's not always that simple because entertainment value at the end of the day must be considered, and the average guy tends to like the villain, so. Hide and Seek is expected to start screening on Independence Day. There is a problem. 8.4 million dollars missing.